A couple of weeks ago, we told you about a worker at the state fair accused of touching a teenage girl's private parts while she was getting on a ride. Well, now that guy's out of jail, but while he was behind bars, he took a couple of beatings. As Nancy Laughlin reports, both were caught on camera. For inmate Raymond Johnson, it was a double whammy and a double whooping. Johnson is accused of touching a girl inappropriately at the state fair while working for a company that operates rides on the Midway. Apparently, he wasn't too popular with another inmate. It's caught on surveillance video at the Metropolitan Detention Center. MDC says the first hits came while Johnson was at a holding facility downtown operated by police. An inmate there went after him. A spokeswoman for MDC tells us when the two guys left downtown Albuquerque, they were transported to the jail separately. But once they got here, boom, it happened again. They say within seconds, six corrections officers tried to put a stop to the brawl. MDC says when they're in the process of booking inmates into the facility, they're not separated. As for Johnson, he bonded out within a week of his charges. MDC says the other guy is Tony Lee Baca. According to a New Mexico court's website, he's got a rap sheet that dates back more than a decade and is still locked up. Now the DA says Baca was charged with battery because of this brawl. As for Johnson and the charges from the state fair incident, a spokeswoman for the district attorney says they are reviewing his case. Doug. After Johnson's arrest, affairs general manager said they were taking a much closer look at companies the state contracts with to make sure all workers pass a criminal background check. Two Albuquerque